हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू माय चैनल बुक ऑफ साइंस टुडे आई एम टीचिंग अबाउट एक्टिव ट्रांसपोर्ट एथ क्लास बायोलॉजी फर्स्ट चैप्टर ट्रांसपोर्टेशन इन प्लांट्स टुडे वी आर डिस्कसिंग एक्टिव ट्रांसपोर्ट इन प्रीवियस क्लासेस वी हैड ऑलरेडी डिस्कस्ड डिफ्यूजन ऑस्मोसिस सो व्हाट इज द मीनिंग ऑफ एक्टिव ट्रांसपोर्ट इन द एक्टिव ट्रांसपोर्ट the water is absorbed by the root hairs in the soil by the process of osmosis then it diffuses into deeper root central portion there are xylem vertical tubes are xylem which continues upwards into the stem and leaves this upward movement of sap contains water and minerals called ascent of sap here we can discuss with the diagram this one this is root here in the osmosis process the root hair absorbs the water and the water enters into the root hair and after then it will moves in the center part of the xylem center part of xylem after entering into the xylem how the water enters from downwards to upwards so stem also have xylem and leaves also have xylem how in the root the xylem water how enters into the upside so ascent of sap ascent of sap ascend means ascending order ascending order means ascending means from downward to upwards so water is ascending order how it uh, will moves from upwards from downwards to upwards sap means fluid sap means fluid means here water and minerals water and minerals are sap so in this process we can learn small mind map absorption of water absorption of water absorption means absorption of water from soil to root hair what is the process we know osmosis process next ascent of sap in this process there are two types of actions held first one is root pressure second one is transpiration root pressure transpiration first we can discuss about what is the meaning of root pressure how the pressure is created in the root first of all we can discuss with the diagram this is the root structure this one here this part i will show the diagram i will draw a rough diagram for your neat understanding this is the cortex part and these are all cells cortex these are all cells this is the cortex this part this part is cortex this is root hair okay this is root hair this is cell wall cell wall here where is the xylem and phloem here this is xylem द 
this is the xylem the center part this is xylem the remaining part are phloem so these are all these are all phloem here this is root here it means this is a soil soil root hair speciality we know root hair has larger surface area and it only allows the liquid or water and it has high concentrated for your neat observation i will give numbers 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 17 18 19 20 21 22 23 24 25 26 27 28 29 30 31 32 33 34 35 36 37 38 39 40 41 42 43 44 45 46 47 48 49 50 51 52 53 54 55 56 57 58 59 60 61 62 63 64 65 66 67 68 69 70 71 72 73 74 75 76 77 78 79 80 81 82 83 84 85 86 87 88 89 90 91 92 93 94 95 96 97 98 99 100 1 here low concentrated solution in the soil here high concentrated solution in the root hair so the water enters by the process of osmosis whenever the water enters into the root hair in the root hair the solution is diluted so it will becomes low concentrated so here low concentrated automatically inside the cortex cells have high concentrated so these are all high concentrated do you know these are all high concentrated why because the water absorption is continuously occur so here the water is diluted so what is the osmosis process from the low concentration solution to high concentration so here is the low concentrated here high concent so the water enters when the water enters the high concentrated solution automatically diluted so it becomes low concentrated so here is low concentrated here high then the water molecules moves second cell next it will diluted after it will becomes low concentrated so here is the high concentrated solution so the osmosis process is continuously occurs and finally the water molecule enter into the xylem so this is the process how the osmosis is very important to absorption of the water is very important this is the process here the pressure developed in the root due to the continuous flow of water this pressure helps in pushing the water upwards due to this pressure water enters into the xylem vessels through the cortex cells of the root by osmosis root pressure is one of the force to help ascent of sap through the stem into the leaves to a certain height so here is the diagram the water enters into the xylem here in this process the pressure is created in the root so the pressure is created in the root so the water is enters in the this is xylem water enters into the xylem in this pressure the water molecules is moves from down side to upwards stem leaves etc so the root pressure is very important in this topic thank you everyone please like share and subscribe to my channel